Hi YouTube! Hi again. So, um, I am going to be reviewing the garment steamer for clothes at Amazon. I got it at Amazon. I got it, um, what is it called? Like, not, yeah, refurbished, not new. Because, you know, that stuff is way easier. And, you know, not easier. I meant cheaper. Less money. And it looks pretty decent. So it came with the the directions. Um, so there those are. I don't even know if you can actually even read that. <laughs> but I can read some. It basically says fill it with water. I'm not reading all that. I'm going to be honest. I have a light back of my phone that is new for me doing that trying some new stuff out I'll read this it says place the garment on a clean rust free hanger direct the steam nozzle towards the bottom of the garment steam will rise both in the inside and outside of the fabric remove the wrinkles and creases slowly slide the the steam nozzle you slowly slide the steam nozzle okay. upward from the bottom to the top of the garment. Direct the steam nozzle away from the garment and smooth the fabric with your, with your free hand. Repeat necessary until the garment is seized free. And it says, you know, unplug, you know, unplug, you know, make sure it's dry because you don't want that to have like mold and stuff in it if you don't use it often. So, yeah. And then it basically tells you some troubleshooting. Um, so here it is. It came, it does have the little cup. It came with a little cup. I'll get that later. So here's this piece. And then this came off. So these were all separate pieces. The cord came tied up with a little zip tie thing. Plastic zip tie. Cord pretty long I don't know how long it is it looks around 10 feet so as you see behind me we got my two garments that I are uh, wrinkled kind of enough and that is what I am going to be testing this on so I am going to go grab that little cup it's back here so I already got the water I'm going to work on starting to edit stuff, but for right now, it's one take <laughs> or pause and a lot of stuff, but I'm going to try my best. So, I'm going to just pour this in here. So, I poured the 200, two, 250 mill, milliliters in here, and that's how um, high it goes. You cannot really see that at all, but it is okay. So basically the cup goes from 50 milliliters and up. There's a little space at the bottom to go underneath 50 milliliters if you just want a little bit. I don't know if you should add a little bit. You probably shouldn't. You should probably, I should probably read about that. So um, I'm going to go ahead and plug this in to my cord right here. So when I plugged it in, you can see a little red light came on, because it's on. Oh yeah, because it was on, on. Make sure, oh, don't do like what I'm doing. Make sure it's closed. You can um actually have the head um this way or that way. I don't know why you would want it towards your hand, but you can. And on the side of the thing, it does say um how much, how much you uh, have in there. Which I should have a pipette. Should have had a pipette. So, the only reason why I'm not, like, you may be like, just use an iron, like, you know, normal. No, I do like ironing, but I did find that sometimes I just want to go a little bit faster. I'm gonna pour this water out. Well, there's a little bit extra that I didn't use. So, as that heats up, I don't know if I should pause this and then, you know, continue, but um, I guess I can start timing it. I should have probably been started that, 
But let's see. We're gonna go to a timer. But it seems like it's gonna do it pretty quick. Like if it does it pretty quick, then it's like just a few minutes. So I know that wasn't accurate because it wasn't quite um paused. It's quite started. But I'm just gonna let this heat up and then I'll see how long it heats up and I'll cut back to the video. Okay, I'm back. So it just started steaming. It takes like three minutes, basically. So we're gonna try to do this. I'm probably not gonna be the best, but let's see. I'm going to just start it out. I should have brought the camera a little closer to the garments. Well, I can do this half of the shirt. I'll bring the shirt closer real quick. Ah, I almost fell. <laughs> so, um, I don't, you can't really see the, the wrinkles that, that well. Let's see. Yeah, you kind of can see them. Um, well, if you can't, sorry. I did my best, I'm still learning. The body isn't really that hot. These are like cotton polyester garments too, so I'm not gonna say really. It actually does a pretty good job, especially it does pretty good job. It's not perfect, so I do recommend like if you are a perfectionist, get that iron because the iron is you know way better. But for me, I just noticed that I just really wanted something that was like maybe they have something where it's grabbing down. Or it's pressed. So, so yeah, I actually am loving it. First, I didn't know if I should press it on the garment, but I just said, you know what? Like, what the heck? It is looking really, really good. Now the pantsuits over here. Can you really see the wrinkles? Let's see. Let's bring it closer. I don't know if you can. Because for me, sometimes I can't tell if something is wrinkled. I don't know if that's just like me being me. So I'm gonna put that right back. How much water do we have? Oh, we still got like a lot of water left. It really is um, doing a good job. I wish I did have a camel person because it would be nice. It does have a little bit of, um, you know, a little bit of water that comes out. You know, you see it on the little garment, but I feel like it's not that bad. Now, I am tilting it a little to see if any water comes out. Tilting it, you know, where we screwed it in at. The steam is very, very hot. <laughs> it's, it's hot. It's not like, I wish I got burnt hot. Like, more like you touch something. That was high, and if you keep your hand on it for a little bit longer, you may get burnt. Give me a second, I hear someone. So I went ahead and only finished the front side of the pants, doing the back side. I know it's kind of boring without music. I should start adding music in it. Um, if I add Nightcore in the background, is that like copyrighted music? I guess I should look that up. But I could definitely add some nightcore music or some, in, yeah, any type of nightcore music, I guess, because I could play like country, pop, rap. It does spit out water sometimes, and that can hurt. That will hurt you. And <laughs> that will hurt you. I'm gonna say can. Like, like the water gave it a choice. But I don't think the water would be that bad as long as you are. You know, give it some time to dry, like 10 minutes, you know, so definitely, I can see this is a last minute option, but I, again, this one, it is pretty good. I like it. I did want, like, the, you know, probably get a better steamer, but, you know, I said, let me be on a budget. Let me not always get it. So, I'm going to show y'all the results. I like it. 
Um, it's not that heavy. Well, maybe because I, I like lift, <laughs> but not like that much. Not like a lift, bro. Not like that. But it is like I guess straining if you don't hold stuff in your hand a lot. Depending on the height you have it, we are all done. So um, I think I did a pretty, it did a pretty good job. It may not be perfect, but it just needs to be like interview ready kind of. And I still have a lot of water left, so you probably I don't need that much water for this. But yeah, I really like it. It did a pretty good job, and it did it quickly. I I really like it. So this is just what I did. I was just bringing it close. I just brought it side to side, drew it up and down. Now these were. Let me get the thing on this fabric real quick. Lyocell, Lyocell um fabric, cotton polyester. The basic, your your normal. My normal shirt here, your normal button-up shirt. So yeah, my end cap of this, since this video is getting kind of long, <laughs> is it's good, it's great. Um, I wish it did have like a button, like if you can like press more steam, like a big gush. But you know, it was um, around twenty-five dollars around that mark because I got it not new, not new, but yeah i say yeah this is a pretty good decent around 19 dollars and 25 dollars steamer and it does a pretty good job so yeah this was the hl6 steamer so yeah you can uh subscribe if you want i don't know what i post i do make videos sometimes and i don't post them so I may put some out, but I don't know what I'm going to do yet. So, you know, if you like my stuff, I guess like it. If you don't, don't like it. Okay. Well, that's it. Bye. Have a good day.